Hey guys, um, I just decided to do my first uh, trade video. Um, yeah, this is all the stuff I have up for trade. Uh, if any of you guys are interested, just reply to my video below. Um, got quite a few of these. Let me know if you're interested, and you know I'll let you know if I don't have any left. So, but I had quite a few of them available. Uh, 18 bands. Pretty sweet looking car. Uh, Toys R Us exclusive. I'll just bring it into the light here. Uh, no number up top. Pretty cool. Bone shaker with the uh, closed roof. Really sick car. Just email me if you're interested. Or, sorry, just reply to the video below. Got some errors. Um, this guy here. Uh, sorry about the glare. Doesn't have any gold on the front tire. You guess you can pretty much see. Um, this one again doesn't have any gold on the front tire. This bottom one here doesn't have any gold. Um, no side decals or tampos on the bottom one there. Uh, no side decals on the top one. Short card. Um, I don't know if any of you guys are interested in these Fuge designs. Uh, 1970 Monte Carlo. Silver. Uh, supposedly this is guy's pretty rare. 1970 Ford Mustang. Another Fuge designs. Um, this one doesn't have any paint. Actually, it's kind of like a, uh, I forget what they call it, but I s saw it sell on eBay for like 20 bucks loose. So I thought that was pretty cool. Um, do have two treasure hunts up for trade. This is an American card, as you can see. Uh, 41 Willys. Pretty, pretty much mint card. Super Rap Bomb. Really nice car. Like, really nice. One of my favorite supers. If any of you guys are interested in any of this stuff, um, I am interested in trading for regular treasure hunts. Just let me know which ones you have, and I'll let you know if I have them or not. Um, I got a list of supers here that I will need. Um, you know, a couple of the 2007 V16 Mega Thrust. Uh, Baja Beetle 2010, Grand Sport 2011, GTO OCC 58 Impala. Those are just a few of the. I think I need like 19 from 2007 to 2011 of the supers. So uh, yeah, just let me know which ones you have if you're interested in any of this stuff. Um, yeah. Um, one thing to kind of just uh, put into consideration, it does cost me. A little bit more to uh, ship items from Canada to the States. Um, I uh, shipped something to a guy down in California and it cost me eight bucks. And that was by air. Um, uh, by ground was like a dollar cheaper. Figured I'd just do it by air. Um, and it, it got to me and it only costed him $4.56. And it cost me like eight oh eight ten eight eleven something like that I forget but um, just something to keep in consideration um, so yeah um, and another thing um, I don't like uh, I probably I would be interested in buying some of these I guess off of some of you guys off my list here some of these supers. Um, one thing I don't like the shipping costs, so you know most of you guys probably wouldn't be willing to pay as cheap as I'd like them for, because including shipping, you'll want probably 20, 25 bucks for a super. And I normally try to get them for 15, 15, 20 for some of the really rare ones. So um, you know, for maybe 15 bucks, I would be willing to pay for some of these, but that's including shipping. So most of you guys probably won't want to pay. Won't want to sell them that cheap, so um, yeah. So hope some of you guys are interested in some of this stuff, and I will uh, see you guys later. Bye.